Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn how to solve linear equation by using matrix method or inverse matrix method. So we have a two equations. Let's take a start. Given equations writing in matrix form. First of all, we have to write in matrix form this given linear equation so first of all we have to write on the coefficient of x what is here 2 so 2 coefficient of y is minus 1 so write, write minus 1 coefficient of x is 3 so 3 coefficient of y is nothing then here we can write on 1 and here we have to write on x y and equal to after equal what is here constant number 1 9 so we have to write on 1 9 which is in the form which is in the form of a x is equal to b so here what is the value of a so we can write here where a is equal to 2 minus 1 3 1 x is equal to the value of x is x y and the value of b is equal to what is here 1 9 so we have value of a x and b after this we have to find out the determinant of a so we have to check either this is singular matrix or non-singular matrix so a determinant a is equal to 2 minus 1 3 1 let's find out determinant first of all we have to multiply the main diagonal 2 into 1 2 minus and here minus so it will be plus 3 into 1 3 this main diagonal we have to multiply minus and this to multiply minus minus plus 3 into 1 3 which is equal to 5 which is not equal to 0 so a is non singular matrix we have to write here if singular then determinant 0 if uh, a is a uh, determinant a is not equal to 0 then a is non singular so a inverse x exit so we can find out the value unique value of x and y because a is non singular matrix now what we have to do we have to find out cofactors or we can say adjoint of a so let's find out adjoint a adjoint a means in transpose of cofactor what is the cofactor cofactor of 2 means 1 so we have to write here 1 okay cofactor of minus 1 is 3 so we have to write here minus 3 and cofactor of 3 is minus 1 minus and minus it will be plus so we have to write 1 cofactor of 1 is 2 so we have to write here 2 and here we have to write on transpose to find out transpose of this we can write here 1 minus 3 1 2 so we have a, a transpose is equal to 1 1 minus 3 2 so finally we have to find out a inverse how to find out a inverse directly also you can do it or step by step also you have to do 1 by determinant a and here we have to write down adjoint a 1 by determinant a is equal to we have 5 so write on 5 adjoint a is equal to we have 1 1 minus 3 2 now we know that what is the value of x we know that x is equal to a inverse b so we we wrote here ax is equal to b so when you take a to the right side it will be a inverse so here we can write a x is equal to a inverse b what is the value of x x is equal to here we have x y so we have to write here x y is equal to a inverse a inverse we have 1 by 5 1 1 minus 3 2 and the value of b is equal to we have 1 9 so we have to write here 1 9 now we have to multiply this to term 1 by 5 let's multiply 1 into 1 1 1 into 9 means 9 minus 3 into 1 minus 3 plus 2 into 9 18 hope you understand up to here 1 by 5 we can solve this 10 and when you minus plus minus we have to subtract but sign should be positive because 18 is greater when you subtract we get 15 now we have to multiply this so we can write here x y is equal to 1 by 5 into 10 similarly 1 by 5 into 15 both the elements uh, 10 and 15 we have to multiply by 1 by 5 so we can get here x y is equal to 5 2 is a 10 and 5 3 is a 15 therefore x is equal to 2 and y is equal to 3 is the answer hope you understand this video how to solve by using matrix method or we can say inverse matrix method which is very important for class 10 as well as for class 11 12